Yo, what's up? Real quick, real briefly, I'm going to tell you why you're not popping off like you think you should be popping off, even though you're better than average. And this applies to musicians, entrepreneurs, people who sell food, T-shirts, whatever you sell, cars, this or that, whatever. Right now, we're going to speak in reference of your product, your brand, whatever it is that you push. And hamburgers, the terms of hamburgers. You got the tastiest hamburger, this bombest hamburger ever, right? Way better than Big Macs. So why isn't your hamburger selling more than Big Macs? Well, because your competition, Big Macs, McDonald's, they spend millions of dollars every day on marketing, promo, PR, all of that, billboards, radio ads, millions of dollars every day. You're not doing that. You're never going to do that. You're never going to take the 10000 that you made and go spend it on PR so that a celebrity eats your hamburger on the whoop de whoop show. You're not about to do that. You're not going to run billboards and Facebook and Instagram ads because you're not going to see the results the second that you spend that money. You're going to spend $500,000. $1, you're not going to see the results the same hour or the same day. It's going to take a little bit of time, but you will see the results. But you're not willing to wait for the results. You don't want the patience. You just think, oh, because it's so good, they should be posting my shit. Everybody should be talking about it. Everybody doesn't know about it. Why they don't know about it? Because you're not marketing and promoting it. Something that McDonald's does very well. And that's why millions of people buy Big Macs every day, and they don't buy your hamburger. AKA your product, your music, your merch, whatever you sell. Big Trap, I'm out.